Arsenal did not pay £105 million for Declan Rice. So the last-minute winners scored goals. Instead of winning, they bought mold games. However, this is midfielder personality force and this is taste for moments defining match. When he decides to seize event on his own seems to not stop. When Rice won late winner against Manchester United at beginning of this season, he may have thought that season had at least top of goals. However, in the last second of the most chaotic matches, this vibrating hood must have felt even more sweet. The seventh goal of Knight scored a goal in 97th minute, it would not be bigger than that. And players are not greater than man who directs Arsenal midfield in best way in terms of his stability and stability. For most of this season, Arsenal was the calm control masters of the Premier League, and then they came to the Kenilworth Road in this section and found themselves wandering around in an unwanted and unexpected world of chaos. Before this trip to Luton Town, Arsenal had scored three league goals from home all season, in 57 minutes. This installment doubled. Nevertheless, what is about chaos may be the most fun, especially when it ends like this. Mikel Arteta wanders with pleasure and Arsenal players pour away in a sea of swinging limbs, they are moments that come a path. In reality, the rice was already worth money without targets. To add these goals, on top of everything else, many of them really disrupt the Arsenal supporters who will spend their nights on what they can do. To Luton's next defense, the Cuffs will rightly focus on Rice, but the role of Luton on this sensational football evening should not be ignored. Rob Edwards sent his side with real quality at the key points of the game with all usual aggression and intensity. Even if Luton scored three goals, the nature of his goals started more uncomfortable questions for Arsenal goalkeeper David Raya. It was a measure of their quality. The span lost his coolness, allowed Elijah to skip by Adebayo and then could not save Ross Barkley's low shot.